This is Scott Bauer with Prosper Trading Academy and your Cebovol 411. What's the difference between the VIX and the new one-day VIX? Well, the VIX provides a rating of constant 30-day expected volatility in the S&P 500 index, and the calculation comes from real-time, mid-quote prices of SPX options with expirations 23 to 37 days. The VIX number, if you will, it's an annualized expectation for the standard deviation of the S&P 500. The rule of 16 applies to the VIX, meaning that if the VIX calculation is 16, that corresponds to really a 1% daily move in the S&P. There are also other volatility indices, all using the same methodology as the VIX, such as the three-month, the nine-month, and one-year timeframes. But with the surge in volume of shorter dated options, specifically one or zero DTE, the SIBO has developed the one-day volatility index. The calculation for the one-day VIX is unique is in that it is nearly weighted to the current day's expiring SPX options, but as the day progresses forward, starts to shift over to the following day. Also, the one-day VIX is in business days, whereas the regular VIX is calculated in calendar days. The VIX one-day index, is it really is expected to reflect short-term impacts when volatility rises, such as what happened about a month ago or so when we had the big banking crisis. This is Scott Bauer with Prosper Trading Academy and your Cebovol 411.